making our news headlines. Speaking at the reopening of the McDowell James Center in the Gutter community, New Zealand's ambassador to the Caribbean, Jan Henderson, says that Dominica and New Zealand have shared an amicable and fruitful relationship over the years. And Henderson stated that although New Zealand may be far away geographically, the countries share a close bond. You know, New Zealand might be a country that looks on the map to be a long way from Dominica. But we have long-standing links. We have our Commonwealth heritage. We have trade. I am very pleased to see New Zealand Anchor Cheese is still popular here. And of course, we have our shared passion for cricket. And the ambassador pointed out that assisting with the refurbishment of the community center is only a fraction of the relationship between the two countries. But the flood relief project is only a part of the engagement partnership between New Zealand and Dominica. In geothermal, New Zealand is providing technical assistance as your government develops this very important renewable energy. In agriculture, we have been pleased to be requested to support the development of your sheep and goat sector. In education, we have scholarships available for postgraduate training in the priority sectors of renewable energy, agriculture and disaster risk management. I am delighted that three students from Dominica have recently been awarded scholarships to study in New Zealand. And that's, that's a really key piece of the relationship. It's the people-to-people -people links that actually make a relationship between countries. And that was Jan Henderson, New Zealand's ambassador to the Caribbean.